Okay, so we're gonna do a vision correction problem here. So myopic means that the uh, the lens of the eye has too much curvature. Right, that means that light that comes in from a distance and it comes in parallel, it hits the eyeball and it comes to a focus too quickly before it reaches the retina back here. Right, so what we need is some kind of a diverging lens to correct things so it comes in, it's diverging so that the corrected rays meet at the right place. So we need a diverging lens to correct. The idea is that the diverging lens will take an object out here at infinity and create an image at the person's far point, at the normal far point for the eye. Okay, so that for the eyeball here, the eyeball is going to think that the object is here. So we, if we want to correct the far point, we're told that for an object that's at infinity, so the object's at infinity, we want the image to be 38 centimeters in front of the lens. So minus 38 centimeters, right? That's our convention, is that if, if an image is in front of the lens, we say that it's got a negative image distance. All right, so with that object distance and that image distance, we just gotta find the focal length. So one over infinity plus one over negative 38 is one over F. So F is negative 38 centimeters. Now, we want the optical power so the optical power is 1 over the focal length in meters, so 1 over negative 0.38, which is negative 2.6 diopters. So there's our answer for part A. Now for part B, a little more complicated, it says what's the new near point for the professor wearing such a, such a lens? Alright, so the near point is the closest place that an object can be. So, right, the, the far point is the furthest place an object can be. So we want the lens to form an image at the far point. Now we want to know what P forms an image at the near point, right? So see how this works? You're putting an image at the far point and you're putting an image at the near point. Okay, and we already know the focal length, so now we can solve for P. So 1 over P plus 1 over negative 17 is equal to 1 over negative 38. Okay, so if I, if I do it this way, 1 over negative 38 uh, minus 1 over negative 17. If I do that in decimals, I get 0 0.0325, which gives me a P of 31 centimeters. Okay, so my new glasses give me a range that goes from 31 centimeters to infinity, which is pretty close to the normal range.